What's up everybody, this is Nate Sosi from the Navajo Nation here at Airbrush Las Vegas. We're gonna do a Freddy hat and we're gonna show you how it's done. Right now we're gonna be using a 3M uh, 45 general all-purpose adhesive. We spray the back of the stencils to get them to stick. Outline Freddy first with red. It's gonna be a little bit of a bigger, a little bit more overspray on this. After you spray it the first time, sometimes the, the color when it dries, it tends to fade just a little bit. So going over it one more time will really make the, the yeah, design pop. Now I'm gonna fix all the overspray on the hat. You see all the overspray that I, I put on there. It's easy to do because it's black. Add a little bit of movement to the background, and I do that with just some simple dagger strokes. And we don't always get a clean. Uh, Stencil. And so we have to go through and we have to fix some of that. The other thing I want to remember to do and make sure to do is to connect all the lines. Um, because it is a stencil, there will be some. Uh, some places that you need to connect. When I do my Freddy faces or my Freddy, uh, Freddy bears, I use three colors. I use orange, yellow, and brown. We're gonna add a little bit of blue around the eyes and the hat. I don't like to shade the whole hat. Uh, I shade about half, maybe a little more than half of the, of the white area and then really carefully in the eye. Thank you for tuning in. This is Nate Sosi with Airbrush Las Vegas and a little demonstration of how to do a Freddy Fazbear hat.